My name is Ruth and I believe in Jesus. John 3.16 says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. For God so loved you, for God so loved me, for God so loved all of us, that he sent Jesus Christ, his only Son, his only begotten Son, to die for us. You see, God commended his love toward us in that while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. Jesus loves you very much. He loved you so much that he stayed on that cross. He was pierced, he was mocked. His clothes were stripped of him. But Jesus stayed on that cross because he loves you, because he loves me, because he loves us. Jesus loves you and nothing can separate you from his love. No height, no depth, no angels, no principalities, nothing can separate you from Jesus' love, from God's love. He loves you with an everlasting love. And he draws you with loving kindness. Come to Jesus today. Come to Jesus and be ye saved. Come to the Messiah. Come to the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. You see, what shall it profit a man if he gains the whole world but suffers the loss of his own soul? What will it profit us if we gain the whole world, if we have the best jobs, if we have all the money and all the riches in the world? But if we don't have Jesus, we are lost, we are empty. We are bound. Jesus saves. Jesus heals. Jesus protects. Come to Jesus today. Come to Jesus and be free. You see, Jesus is the way. Jesus is the truth. And Jesus is the life. There is no other way. Jesus is the only way. Will you say yes to Jesus today? Will you open up your heart to him? He's standing at the door of your heart and he's knocking. And he's asking for permission to come in. Jesus wants to come into your heart. Jesus wants to come into your life. Jesus wants to come into your home. Jesus wants to be with you till eternity. Will you say yes to Jesus today? Will you turn away from all your sin? Will you repent and invite Jesus into your heart?